I'm Steve Goldson. I'm the Deputy Mayor of New York and I served some time and Director of the Innovations in the American Government Program at the Harvard's Kennedy School. We're basically looking at how to induce innovations uh, in city government, right? What, what are the tools to do innovation? Uh, how, what are the structures? How do we give workers more discretion? How do we involve community organizations? There's a lot of hierarchical command and control work that's done in cities. Problems are too complex, resources are too few. We really need to infuse new sources of kind of catalytic, disruptive innovation, and there's methods to do it that we're trying out in New York City now. Well, one uh, way to think about this is structural. Right? How do you set up units whose responsibility is innovation, del delivery units, if you will, policy units? Uh, uh, Mayor Bloomberg has a a social service program called CEO that is seeded with a couple hundred million dollars to induce new ideas and collaborative performance in terms of social network. We have a, a sustainability unit that's designed to look across all government agencies and cause uh, changes in the way we approach uh, sustainability issues. We have an operations unit that looks and measures rigorously using analytics and performance measurement to identify weak points in the operations and the delivery system. So it's a combination of policy innovation across the top and operational innovation on the side. So I think what's next for New York is how to use collaborative tools, right? How to innovate across the verticals of government and connect to communities so you have both kind of the wisdom of crowds mixing with the collaboration. Combine that with a whole new view of predictive analytics so we can identify where the problems are going to occur and then use neighborhood suggestions as part of the solutions. Well, this is an uh, extraordinary group of individuals I had the opportunity to kind of participate with. They're, they're deeply involved in different aspects of both business and nonprofits and city government. Uh, and inherent in uh, solutions for the future, they all relate to leadership. You know, leadership in one of the sectors that understands that enlightened participation with another sector, you know, for-profit, non-profit, government, will produce the value we need. And governing by network is really the only way to do it.